ओके फाइव कंपनीज आर लुकिंग फॉर माय फ्रेशर्स वेयर दे रियली वांट टू रिक्रूट फ्रॉम आर इंस्टीट्यूट एंड स्पेशली फ्रॉम माय स्टूडेंट्स ओके द ओनली थिंग मिसिंग इज पीपल आर नॉट रेडी स्टूडेंट्स आर नॉट रेडी ओके सो वी हैव टू वी हैव टू गेट इन टू दैट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल भार्गवी हैव यू कंप्लीटेड द असाइनमेंट गिवन कंप्लेन मी like i am not able to understand that this this that this is all happens because progressively you are not completing the assignments that is what your mistakes are okay yes sir i'll just please uh, yeah i'll message in app on that please please abhi and uh, abhi i have seen your okay kaushik sir have you done that guys uh, or not sir i done sir how to send to you sir i have um, the card actually there is a great uh, application maybe you don't know that that is called as whatsapp okay ah, okay sir yeah okay, even sir. through whatsapp also you can send I and think, uh, unfortunately I... google is also giving us uh, some free drive and email system also maybe you don't know you can uh, attach your files and send me or else i can book a ticket to you i'll come श्रीकांत Yeah, sir. I have completed one. So today I will complete uh, second one also. By mm-hmm. evening, I will send it to you. Yeah, very good, very good. See, your interest actually motivates me. Okay, your fees will uh, give me survival, but ultimately the motivation and energy comes by your assignments. How much you submit the assignment? Oh, uh, this okay, good. Abilash, nice. Good to see you. So today we are going to see. few more different elements which are called as forms oh my god what is this form i'll tell you i have already discussed the same point in the past also uh, go for mute guys you voice is coming you feel is it noisy or low no 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 it is okay okay what happened hmm. come on come on okay guys yeah my question is why html is so popular it is good for okay more than anything more than anything html is so simple okay what level of simplicity html is having for example uh, let us say we are all using a bike why we are all using bike i mean not only for tra- transportation why we are all purchasing the bike in such a easy way not because of price come on but it is easy to use If, yes obviously right user friendly why we are not using linux or ubuntu operating system why we are using windows or mac option sir user friendly user friendly and it is easy to use simple to use it is nonsense the same the same start button you will have shut down button also but still it is easy they made it so flexible 
why we are all using google in the whole world do we have only google as a search engine many are there but it is so easy to use why we are using gmail why not you are using hotmail i am asking these many questions answer is same flexible easy simple right why you are using this fan so you, see if you have uh, a bike to so start the bike i think now it is clean yeah it is okay for me yeah maybe someone open the link through the system and mobile and okay. detect it very clear nearby so it's that's what they're getting okay. okay suman thank you so yeah it is so easy to create uh, again one more point one more point is uh why we are using uh mobile phones because it is easy to access easy to use suppose even to start a mobile if it takes lot of time even if it, you to uh, same thing you have to dial something or you have to press so many numbers these all things made consuming and you start leaving it why we are using amazon instead of others not because of uh, uh, okay trustworthy is different but easy to use okay whatever you want to search you can search easily right ah uh, so user easy of you not only for html is so popular not because of it is easy to use it is it is easy to develop first i would like to show you something like this creating a button in java to create a button in java you have to write these many lines of code creating a button in python you need to write these many lines of code creating a button in c++ so they removed also so you have to write lot of code to create a button in c++ this is the way it is not even easy to understand also okay so finally create okay i'll create a button boom here is my button how many lines of code yeah. single line of code it's so easy to add, create first of all even to make it work or even to customize it is so easy but in java if you do the same things in java in python okay it will be like a patha look okay so customization is hell if you want to customize anything for example you want to print it in the center you have to write lot of other code also but in html it is so easy to take the in input from the user okay so you want to apply for a license so you have to fill some form or not what is the best way to fill the form uh, i am coming to that so if i if i if i you need to apply the license for bike 
you have to go to rto okay where is the nearest rto kondapur uh, okay but if you are not uh, lucky enough they will ask you to go to nagol you don't get the slots also nagol so to fill the form to apply for license you have to first go to nagol and there you have to keep you have to be in a line to take the pay ah, sir chala uh, there, there are so many things you have to be in the line stand in the line and after 20 25 minutes they close the counter and say this is the lunch time by 11 30 only <laughs> okay so then after almost all 3 30 they have lunch for three and a half hours or to four hours okay so after 3 30 they will open and again they will ask where is your other card i want only the form sir no no even for the form other card is needed so you will give an other card no 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 i want the big other card uh, finally you will get it and ultimately you will fill the form okay you entered it ah, okay leave all those nonsense but first of all to fill the form you have to put it in the normal page paper while <laughs> the the crazy thing in the uh, filling the form is you have to enter the date that should be month month date date year year but you have given dd mm yy format and you have to write your first name separately last name separately surname separately middle name separately middle name is considered as your father name not actually the uh, for example your name is uh, chandra bose kubbala so bose is not your middle name you have to write chandra bose in the first name Ramara, that is a middle name, your father name. And then, uh, this is the craziest thing. And you have to write everything in the uppercase letters, not in the lowercase letters. You don't know that. You fill it. You give it. And they go for the lunch break. Very crazy. Crazy, crazy. And when you are applying for that, you have to fill the uh, license number of uh, learning. You forgot that and you have to enter this so all these all these things have to be made directly you don't have the validation you have entered the value as 17 so they don't say that right the paper don't say you have entered the wrong input or anything but are you expecting these kind of things in the real world or not so obviously you need a programming so what is the best way to create that? Answer is HTML. If you create only to create a button, you had such a problem. Imagine a big form of two to three forms. How much time you may take to complete that form in Java? Oh, ah, okay. It can complete in one day. Okay, it will not happen in one day, my dear. It will take two, three days. What is the correctness of the program? Nobody knows. But in HTML, you can create such kind of forms in minutes. So ultimately, why we are learning forms? There is a strong emotional reason. Right? Or technical reason. So why HTML is so popular? Why we are all learning JavaScript rather than Java? Why many people are looking into uh, HTML, CSS, JavaScript, React developers, why not Java developers? They are, but why more are these in? The reason is, it is universal, first of all, and it is easy to create. And the speed of the coding will be more faster than Java or anything. Can, you can I tell you one more thing? If you develop a form in Java, you should have Java in your computer. JRE. But if you develop a form in HTML, already browser is there that can be open. If you don't have the browser, then you can do one thing. You take your computer and go, pick up, go to the high tech city junction. You pick up an auto and directly go to tank one, throw your computer there. No other way. 
सो ब्राउजर इज देर इन एवरी कंप्यूटर सो वी आर यूजिंग राइट हाँ ओके ओके आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड वॉट इज द सिंप्लिसिटी एंड वॉट इज द इंपॉर्टेंस ऑफ एच टी एम एल फॉर्म्स सो अल्टीमेटली पॉपुलरिटी ऑफ एच टी एम एल एक्चुअली फॉर द फॉर्म्स मोर देन टेक्सट प्रेजेंटेशन इट इज मोर इजियर टू क्रिएट ए फॉर्म सो बेसिकली वी हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड वॉट इज द फॉर्म वॉट आर द फॉर्म एलिमेंट्स हाउ डू वी अंडरस्टैंड ओके in html5 that is the latest version of html has more number of form fields okay but now we are discussing a combination which are needed for your javascript and further application okay so in a form what all you can see some text boxes where you can write your text there are certain radio buttons where you can select your gender there are certain check boxes where you will select more than one right this is the regular thing yes or no optional any one or and okay so uh, whenever you are putting or then you have to give uh, rounded buttons that is called radio buttons okay so we have to see what are the form elements in htm so here we go form elements in html so okay i thought of you get everything at one place so this is called input box so where you generally enter the text this is called text area where you generally put your addresses or comments or reviews kind of thing this is called a select box and this is for selecting multiple options one of the multiple options this is radio button it also uses for selecting one of the multiple options so here in the radio buttons you can select only one option at a time in select box also it is actually meant for only one at a time but yes multiple selections are also possible but don't worry about that right now so select box is also meant for selecting only one at a time and these are all called check boxes this kind of boxes are check boxes generally they are meant for selecting more than one one option this is called button and you have different types of buttons one is submit button and normal button but button so it if it looks like that that is called button so first we have to create this kind of things this is these are the basic things after that i will extend to it okay so shall we start creating how to we create a form with input box with one input box so chalo so button is already done now i want to create input box to create input box that is text box to create the text box we use an element called input so we write it like this input and then we have to mention the attribute as type then you will be getting a text see here here we have a text box so text box is editable where you can enter the data okay ultimately one more thing why we are creating forms to take the input from the user to take the input from the user in c language you have heard about it there is a language called sir heard i am not asking you any question on it don't worry in c language there is a uh, option called how do you take the input in c language scan f yes or no scan f how do you take the input here through input boxes in html you can't give directly input of course confirm 
all their their prompt box confirm box they are a different but now we take this uh, input from input boxes this is input box input type is equal to text next i will create radio buttons input type is equal to instead of text i have to give radio radio is not marconi radio marconi radio okay not fm this is radio button you must be observing this is not automatically refreshed the reason is if you don't put everything in html and body tag it will not come it will not refresh automatically yeah now it will be refreshed so what is this this is called radio button we will create complex forms calm down ah this is the radio button okay next in the same way input type is equal to check check box you have to write check box gives you a check box i don't know why it is not coming okay should we give it head okay save check box comes with this check box this is check box can you identify what is that how do you create an input element how do you create a text box input element with the attribute type with the text if i give type is check box you get next how to create a text area uh it is not input type so here you have to use text area don't worry text area so that it will give you the text area like this so here you can enter more than one line of the code okay so edupoly is really good and uh, i learn javascript here okay so i can give more than one line as an input generally for reviews comments all kind of things we use check box uh, sorry text area there is also one more input way that is called select box so select gives you like this but it doesn't have any options so in the select element each option should be given with an element called option i will give you whatever the need of any other this is a foundational minimalistic way of creating form option india save and refresh so here you get options right drop down list so each one is called as options so the select box is resembling you with list items do you remember that how you create a list inside the ul each item will be created in li the same way select box also select is the main element inside that each option should be given as one option is that clear super and then we can create a button button imagine save okay so now i have a button when i click on it nothing is actually happening here okay point number 1 is it clear yes so now let us make more uh, appropriate for example 
this input box is meant for full name so here it is not showing anything what i should write it here i need some helper right helper text or something like that it should say something okay so here as a placeholder there is a at another attribute called placeholder placeholder see this is not actually the name but it will show you there enter your full name so in the gray color when i click on it when i start typing it that placeholder will go up go but here ultimately you got enter your full name right the text is printed over there that will come by placeholder but placeholder will be available only to the input box input type is equal to text for for radio buttons check boxes placeholder will not be there right okay so you need some information what i want to do there ah uh, so for that we have an another element called a label so this label will give you the meaning of i mean what exactly you are about to enter into it hello is it okay what is label label doesn't make any big difference it gives you some text it gives you some text okay in front of your thing okay so now but what is okay you are already experienced in html and css what i forgot your name mohan oh no mohan on ah oh, sorry raja raja what is the purpose of label is it only about this full name apart from, what are the attributes you know for the label any attributes are there label uh, for in the label no ah uh, like this you, there are so many things to be learned in every aspect okay careful so uh, yeah what is the purpose of for why what is the need of it how where id is that so in the input field we have to give the id this is the meaning okay so this id should have something like fn imagine i have given an id to this so the same id should be given to for in the label oh, no not no need of uh, hash hmm. so when i click on the full name it automatically comes to the input field to which you have connected okay so this is an interview question many people will give up this what is the purpose of uh, label many people don't answer many many i am saying many but as interviews they will look into it what is the purpose of it and this is very much needed friends because of your um, html specifications there are certain specifications where you have to follow them so that your pages will be good ranked in the search engine okay point number 3 for voice readers i mean sorry uh, audio read uh, audio generators are readers readers ante the meaning is your page will be giving you some audio okay i'll tell you in some of the tvs now voice inputs are coming up right okay go to first name 
it directly goes to first one. There will be a form in the TV also. Even for audio inputs also, nowadays they are using it there. Okay. So definitely labels are very important on clicking on the label to point or to focus on a particular input field. We use for, what is that? For in the label. For for attribute, what do we pass the value? That is an ID of respective input field. Ardhamainda? Sure. Chapo. Okay. So next, next I want to end, I want to select my gender. So here break. So that I can have a break. So in the next line, I want to select a gender. So for gender, what I should do? Should I use label or not? Should I say that or not? Gender. Yes, yes, yes. Huh. So here I will be using not label as a as a B. I'll be giving gender. Because I okay, okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Huh, correct. Gender. Okay. Mm. Save gender. So here in the gender, I need at least three options. Male female and others. So how many radio buttons I have to keep? Three. So first radio button, second second radio button and the third radio button. And after that you need a break. But which will be male and which will be female? Hello? We need to mention it or not? Hmm? After radio button, you have to mention there, right? How do you mention that? Using label. Already radio button is there. L A B E L label. Is it clear? So after the radio button, I'm giving the label. And after the, after this radio button, I had to give label for label. I'll come back to that for female. So if you are not finding out that is too interesting, please give two breaks. Huh. Gender, male, female, and Others. Oh. Yeah. So now I am able to select the gender. Is it okay? Is it clear? Hmm. Sir. Next. You have to select the uh, options, one of the options. I want to select it like technologies. So I will do some bold. And for every checkbox, after every checkbox, I want uh, content. So here angular node.js express.js mongodb react.js bootstrap java python so I have all the technologies stacks, whatever you want to select, you can. So after that, I would like to break. Right. Next, the same way. Text area. Here I have a label 
and the label is remarks. Here the label that is country. Please have the break. Okay. So just I have created a simple basic form. Correct. But this is not completely correct. What are the problems I have? First, let us go. Huh? Name problem. In the good. Amy Valley. Let us see the gender. I can select male. When I if I select female, then the male should go away. Only one input should be selected. Raja Indu Kravatle, why it is not coming? Why it is not selecting only one? Ah, okay. So here. Winner Gadai class Motum. Amar even Chapu. That is for selecting the element. Ah. Yeah. So, so the missing thing is name for every input field. Every input field should have a name one name and a value for input type is equal to text that will be there first of all let us understand the name so name will actually group all the radio buttons even though you have three options all the three options are meant for only one purpose right generally for every input field we give different name i repeat for every input field we give name differently name is for different only but here in this case radio button is having name with the same value so here i have to give the name like this input type radio name is equal to gen so i have to give the same name to all the input fields So here, male, female, or others, only one got selected. Why we are giving the same name to all the fields? Because all the three fields, I mean, radio, especially radio buttons, why all the three radio buttons are having the same name? Because ultimately, these three radio buttons are grouped together to select only one. To group them, we are giving same name same name clear perfect so name next all these things should be under the form because when we click on a submit button okay when we click on a button is equal to button type is equal to submit save so when i click on it it is supposed to submit the data to some other place some other server or anything but how that will be submitted where it should be sending you need to give an address okay so definitely this entire form should be kept under one element called form I repeat the point. See why we are collecting the data. When we type some uh, online form, the form will come. Okay. For, for example, I want to create an account in Google. Okay. So for myself. So what is this? Is, is, it, an, is it not a form? Is this not a form? Yes, it is a form. 
So after send after entering the form, I, do I click on uh, next uh, next or not? So why we are clicking on the next? These details should go to the Google server, and Google server take this data, and it will send you some other information. Am I correct? Ah, so how can I submit it? If I click on submit button. Only these fields will be sent or suppose I have some other form in the same page. Which, which particular field should be submitted for this button? Right? So for that, we have to put everything in a element called form. I repeat, we have to put every element in a form. You can have multiple forms, but you should have keep all these things under one form element. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to have form. As I told you, I need definitely the indentation. Without indentation, nothing works. Okay, guys. Sir. Yeah. So here I have a form. So now save it and let us go to the form and let me enter the data. Praveen, Mail, Angular, Express, Bootstrap. So as soon as I click on the save, you can see some blink in it. Hello, have you seen it or not? And also yes, in the address bar, you can see some slash question mark. Is there no, no no question mark and gen is equal to on. What the hell is that? So it is trying to submit the data to some server, but you have not given any address. You said form submit, submit it. So if you don't provide any address to the form, it will submit to itself. <laughs> we have to give the address. The address should be given in, in the form as an attribute called action. Action is equal to naistam.com. Naistam. Uh, HTTP colon double slash naistam.com. Save. So now you just go back. See, 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 guys, you remove this, okay? Refresh it freshly. Ah, enter now. Praveen, mail, save. Now it is being submitted to which particular place? Which place? It is submitting to naistam.com. Of course, nystem.com is not available in the internet. It is going to GoDaddy. GoDaddy uh, registered that, uh, re reserved that. It is parked domain. It is parked free. Nystem.com is parked free. Courtesy of Google, GoDaddy. Get this domain to the Nystem. If it is 100 rupees, I will purchase it. I <laughs> 5249. I don't want. Okay. Let Ram Gopal or my purchase this. Only he can purchase that, right? Okay. So here, so what I wanted to tell you is when I click on the submit button or save button, that is submit button, automatically it is sub submitted to the URL provided in the action. Hello. Okay, so Kaidi movie, Karthi got entered. Not like yesterday. Yesterday you felt it like, wow, these things are simple, simple. It's very easy. I am going to get a job in very no time. Ah, welcome to HTML. not HTML. Uh, complexity. Okay, so like this, every day is a roller coaster ride. Ah, it's not a car drive. And definitely, it is the drive between 
KPHP to high tech city. Do you know about it? Right? Are you have you understood that? Not on the morning. It is exactly at ten forty five. Ah. Uh, not on ten forty five every day on Monday. Not on Monday. Not only on Monday. On week, I mean, long weekend Monday. I, I I'll give you. I'll give you, buddy. Not on only long weekend Monday. On raining long weekend Monday, ten forty five between Kokat Pali to High Tech City. Come at that time. You feel like JavaScript is so easy. <laughs> Are you ready, sir? Or else Friday evening. And that too on a rainy day. Ah, okay. I will send you from High Tech City to Kukat Palliga, Madhi Patnam. On rainy day, it will be hurry. Uh, super. It's un wonderful. Next level. Okay, I know. Balnagar to Kukat Palli, Sikindrabad to uh, Balnagar. Hey, I'll I'll send you. So this is very slow ride, and it is horrible. You have to horn. You have to sweat. You have to take the pollution. You have to feel the stress. Sometimes you feel like leaving the job, or else sometimes you feel like keep that vehicle over there and I'll come back. Ah, all these things will feel. I feel I'll make you to feel that. <laughs> okay, welcome to traffic. Okay, just initiated. You are just entered into forum mall. It's there. <laughs> okay. So now that, sir, I am not trying to threaten you or I am not interested to create a panic feeling in to you, but I want your attention and your commitment towards this. Everything you have to repeatedly watch the video and come back. Okay. Now the next second very important thing is, now why only, why only gender is going up? Hello. Why only gender is going up? Why not first name and last name? Because you have not given any name to any of the fields apart from gender. So every form field should have a name. Every form field should have a name as an attribute with a value. So this is full name. Sir, should I give the same name like that? Not like that. You should have a name. So now say... So here, so why now full name is going out? Hello. As well as gender. Why not the checkbox? I have selected, no? Why the checkbox is not going? Why the radio button? Uh, why the text fields are not, uh, text area is not going? Not sub getting submitted. Ah, we have not given name to them. Ready? So, every form field should have name. What is the importance of the name? This is the importance of the name. Okay. So, those people who are fluctuating between whether should I learn HTML or not. So, please learn. It is not that uh, same. All these are all interview questions. What is the importance of the name? Maybe you know that. I am not saying you don't know, but you never understood the importance of it. In the interview, they will ask you this kind of questions. What is the importance of name attribute? So you should be in a position to tell me what is the importance, Abhilash? If you don't give the name, the, that particular form field data will not be submitted to the server. So this line should be written on your paper while you are watching the video, not now. Okay, so now now come back to the point. So here I know how to give name to input box text, input type text, input type radio. How about input type checkbox? Here also you have to give the same name. By giving same name, it doesn't make only one selection. Don't worry about it. It will give you all the things. 
सर कॉपी पेस्ट द सेम वे टेक्स्ट एरिया शुड हैव अ नेम इवन सेलेक्ट बॉक्स शुड हैव अ नेम से सो नाउ ऑल द फील्ड डेटा विल बी सबमिटेड so now i just refresh this page once again and i will enter the data so there can you see there full name been submitted hello yes sir, sir. no yes sir yes sir after that gen gender after that tech after that remarks after that ctr by all the data have been submitted or not very nice but sir i am not pausing anywhere after that i mean one concept immediately i will start the next it i it will be like a chain it's a continuation okay in a movie also completed one scene and jab tada ah so it's a continuation you have to feel it like that come on so everything is okay but why the gender is on don't think like you have selected male so it is on hey come on <laughs> kill you not like that ah even if you select to female also it is saying on why so on is the right input kya so through gen on can you identify which gender you got selected what is the first name through the url you can identify first name is pravin through remarks you can identify remarks is sds fdf what is the country i have selected but what are the technologies i have selected what are the what is the gender i have selected can you tell me from the i have given the same name selection is not the only value here for radio buttons and check boxes you have to give the value because there is no value for those input fields you have selected no doubt in it but for that selection what is the value you have selected you have another attribute called value for every form field even for input box also there is a attribute called value but you have to learn so here i have to give the value is equal to ang to here the value is equal to expr value is equal to node value is equal to mongo value is equal to react value is equal to bootstrap value is equal to java value is equal to pyt and here also for for male input value is equal to m value is equal to f this is my option if you want to give full name then it is okay male female you can put it like that no problem now you see this 
if i submit it it is showing on only because you have not refreshed the page hello these are the mistakes what do you do you see that it is going not the same way because you have to refresh the page sir ivanni ni enduku chupichali why should i show you all these things ah not only that when you do the practice if you get any error it will give 2 3 it will kill 2 3 hours of time that doesn't mean that every 4 or 5 minutes you have to come to me and ask me the question no that is not the point you have to correct your errors i am trying my best to this kind of errors also possible i am taking care of that also i am taking care of html this level means can you imagine angular can you imagine react can you imagine javascript i will take the same level whatever the problems it are possible i will talk about that also not only about correctness even i try my best to give you what is wrong also i try to give okay at least four to five options will be given which is the wrong also so my teaching is not only about what is correct it is about what is correct what is complete what is needed what is necessary what is wrong what is error what is mistake also all these things i am doing here and i am showing you once javascript starts i don't speak in the same tempo you feel like i almost kill you i almost kill you because i give that importance i give that concern and i am taking care of it when i present such a way if you don't give me the proper response then it is not engineering college this is my academy okay ikkada ittage untadi adi survive ayinode untadi you have to i am not saying anything wrong sir i can give you a free word i can happily speak to you <laughs> simply uh, with a fun and all but ultimately what is happening is you are not focusing on it okay more than your money i need your success only then i can grow to the next level i don't bet on it definitely not okay so this is all needed and i don't give any damn to miss any small small gap ekkadaina chinna gap unna sare nin danni oppon ante ac unna fan gali leda ani cheppi exactly 25 minutes lo konukochina fan ani so i am just saying like whatever the possibility is there i try but at the same so the same importance and the value i am expecting from you also only then the whole course will be fruitful otherwise it will be adura adura aada aada sagam sagam edo kodiga telusu untadi kodiga telavadu it will be like a hair cut aada aada it will look good <laughs> okay yeah if i don't even particular about it other it will become engineering college meer tappu ga ankokandi because i hate that from my core i hate engineering colleges from my core of the heart nalugu samasralu gusse vetti em chepparadu come back come back to this point so full name okay now let me enter praveen mail angular mongodb react remarks well and good and i am from sri lanka say so now all the data are going to full name gender is m text angular 2 mongodb react three values are going not selected things are not being submitted right then remark 
well and good countries sri lanka all these things are given yes sir yeah value should be given to options also if you don't give the option value it will send directly the uh, option text this is called option text india sri lanka nepal pakistan are option texts so you can put a value here value is equal to ind value is equal to sri sri or srl okay Va value is equal to npl nep ankunta value is equal to pak save and now you go back refresh the page remaining things leave it i just want to submit only one thing nep right sir this is about your forms forms right okay so there are few more things let us uh, i mean let us complete that so for example sometimes i want to give the passwords sometimes i want to give the passwords so how can i give the passwords yes here very correct so here password is equal password is the label normal and here you have to use the type is equal to password label is only for printing this attribute value is for giving you a different thing so save and see the output here you have password also but while i am entering it will be coming with dots hello input type is it clear so here i can also have one more input type that is called as dob dob stands for date of birth the type is equal to date so now okay it will be saying and uh, not enter your full name password enter date of birth name is equal to dob please give properly okay name is equal to pwd save mm. so here input type as soon as i change the input type is equal to password it it got the difference but what about input type is equal to date it gives you calendar so you can select it you can go to the calendar and you can select it the date comes sir is it good or bad or else you will enter what what was the error issue int issue em avutundi what is the issue i have enter i, I enter the date in a text box please enter your date of birth date month and year format okay bhargavi correct what is the problem there is no problem but uh, no same 20 01 1990 so uh, mitra is thinking in such a way that january 22nd 1980 maybe or else uh, prashant is so lazy and he he thinks like uh, I am Prashant. Just kidding. Okay. Ah, nineteen April eighty. It Mohan ki dekh koan koan. There is no proper structure, right? Everyone gives their own format. Server will cry. Barbarous. It will cry and die. So you have to give in a proper format, right? So for that, you already give it in a calendar. So select it. Don't write. Okay. So for example, there is. height in centimeters i want height in centimeters 
height type is equal to text imagine so here height oh. okay 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 calm down calm down enter your h e i g h t height in centimeters Can you please? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. He may say six point one. Even after specifying CM, possibilities are there or not? Right? Okay. Avilash is good in English, so he will write one hundred. <laughs> Avilash, please don't mind. Yeah. Huh? So we need only number here. But if I allow the type, I allow the characters, note uh, by possibilities. So users are crazy. You can't bet on them. So here, what I should do? Here, instead of type, you have to put the name. So that here, only Sachin at two, you have to enter the number. Oh. Apart from the number, whatever you try to type. Okay. Even if you type, please, please, oh, please above. Oh, ah, no. Ah, e accepted. Hey, come on. E is accepted because E is also considered as a number. E power two, two point uh, something like that. Okay. This is about type number. Okay. This is about your forms, guys. This is about your forms. You have to structure the forms in a proper way. Clear? Sorry. Yes. So, okay. I have one more thing that is called as validation. Tomorrow, I will be discussing about validations and as well as the anchor tags and single page application tomorrow. Even if you know HTML and CSS, sir, I'm not commenting anybody. As I, you don't know that or not. But I have a flow. I have so many things I have to in, give you input before before actually uh, taking the JavaScript and React. So I tell every day some of the other new issue in that, even if you know. Okay, even in CSS, you enjoy that. You learn something new or not. Okay, but consider. So in anchor tags, while I'm discussing about, I have to explain you about what is single page application. Why we are learning React? What is the purpose? All those things will be explained tomorrow. Are you ready, sir? Yes, sir. What is missing? And I don't want to uh, disturb today's understanding. Create this kind of forms. Read about forms. Already in Edupoly, we have forms. Use it. And uh, also, I will be giving you some assignments. So here you go. HTML forms. Suppose if I ask you to create this kind of form. Of course, normal. Okay, this kind of form. First name. But that, that kind of structure, how can you achieve that kind of structure? Without CSS. You had to use the table. So every form, label, and field should be in one row. Form label in one cell. Form element is in another cell. Hello. Are you getting me? Combine these two things, tables and forms, and achieve this. No compromise at all. This is the assignment for you. I will forward some assignments to you today itself in the chat box. Ready? Chal. That's it, guys. That's it for today. I have other work to do now today. So I am uh, concluding for the day.
Okay. Tomorrow. Kevin, I have a doubt. Yeah, please go ahead, Bargavi. Uh, so actually, you, uh, there are few mandatory columns, right? Like, uh, if you uh, like, we'll I'm filling a form. A uh, few. Ah, uh, required. Like, required uh, fields. Yeah. Required. How do we uh, set, yeah, yeah. like do that? Yeah, we have required fields for uh, validations. Tomorrow, that is the class. Tomorrow we will be. You can put required as a attribute in the form field okay. so that it will become required field also uh, like we gave this region right india and all uh -huh, uh -huh. how do we place that in alphabetical order oh <laughs> very nice uh, but for that you need uh, javascript also okay fine. yeah you need to know the javascript how to use it and all okay, okay. okay guys are you fine yeah we will meet tomorrow at the same time see you bye